welcome to my Primark haul. It's the first haul for my channel as well, which is exciting. Um, but yes, went to Primark Watford today and may have done a little bit of damage. Oh my god! Uh, okay, uh, this is really heavy. <laughs> yes, we've not been to Primark for ages, so it's okay. <laughs> <laughs> we're allowed to well I'm allowed to splurge I keep saying we because if you don't know I am well one half of the adventurers O um, David my husband we had the channel together and so we would do things together film together and we don't now because obviously this is my channel <laughs> um, so I keep saying we a lot I mean we did go shopping together um, but yes anyway Going off on a tangent. Um, yeah, went to Watford, did a little bit of damage, but it was it was good. It's well deserved. <laughs> but anyway, let me get on with this. <laughs> okay, so the first item I will show you is I got some new PJs and oh it's a top, okay. <laughs> oh wait, this is a nighty. <laughs> well, I thought this was a matching top to go with the trousers, but Oh well, never mind. I don't mind long tra long, long tops. But yes, <laughs> stitch night shirt, which I thought was a top. Oh well. Um, and this was five pounds. Oh yeah. See, if I'd have looked at the tag, I probably would have known that it was. <laughs> it was a night shirt. Fail. <laughs> oh well, never mind. But yes, I got this because it was supposed to go with leggings <laughs> it doesn't matter because I've got other stitch t-shirts that can go with these um, I don't really wear night dresses but, oh, I don't mind. but yes I got the stitch leggings which I love it's got this cute little pink waistband with the bow and then just stitch everywhere and then the pink cuff at the bottom and these were eight pounds so yes I mean you could probably wear them together, it would be quite baggy. <laughs> right, next. Staying on the stitch theme. I also got some shorts. Uh, again, just stitch all over. I mean, look how cute he is. Look, he's got a stitch with kisses all over him. Yes, and then picking his nose. <laughs> and yeah, just, just the cuteness that is stitch. I mean Primark are killing it at the moment. They have so much stitch stitch apparel. It's just it's it's good and it's bad because it's bad because now everyone is loving Stitch and we loved him first. Um but good because he's getting the love he deserves. And these I have no idea how much they were because um <laughs> the tag came off. But I think they were four pounds. I have another pair. Uh, so that, it, that, I think they were the same price. Yeah, I got, I got another pair of stitch. David picked these out. <clears throat> but you've got a stitch on here, and it's just mostly plain. I don't know what you call these. Um, but yeah, these were £4, which means that the other pair were £4. So yes, it'll be nice to lounge around the house in when it gets hotter. If it ever gets hotter. <laughs> Okay, next, um, oh, <laughs> I got the stitch, the stitch slippers, but it's got Aloha on the front and cute little pink inside detail with blue flowers. These were five pounds and we had to wait ages for these <laughs> because I saw them on the shelf and I was like, yay, I'm so excited I found them and all they had was large, because these are actually sized. So uh, this is a medium, which is five to six, but all they had on the shelf that I was looking at, which was level with me, uh, was small and large, which just wasn't gonna do. And then I looked up right at the very top and I was like, oh look, there's medium. So we found someone to get them down for us, but uh, yeah, that was <laughs> not fun because it literally was up so high, no one could get that, unless you're a basketball player. <laughs> I think that is it for um, clothing wise. Uh, I did get some t-shirts, just sort of slouchy type of tees, um, just for summer, just you know, 
go underneath a hoodie or something but I got this in blue and it's really really soft and I like the um, like the design of it because it's not just plain blue it's it's got a bit of white in there uh, and this was two pounds which was good so I got that I also got it in a sort of grayish color I apologize if I'm doing this wrong I've not actually done a haul video apart from a Disney World one <laughs> so <laughs> um, I got it in this really nice it's like a rust rust color I love this color um, I got it in this color and oh I got simple black because everyone needs a good black t-shirt then I also saw this which I thought was really cute I love the colors and it's very summery um, again, it's, I don't know if it's the same, ah, see these, these ones are slouchy tees and then this one is just a stretch crew, um, but it's really cute, I love the colours on it and yeah, it's like, I feel like an ice cream in it, <laughs> and this was the same price, I think, £2, but I don't know where the tag's gone, which is weird, oh well. <laughs> So I think that is it for clothing. Yeah, that's it for clothing. I got myself some uh, lace footies for ballet pumps because we're getting to that time of year where ballet pumps are mostly being worn and without tights. <laughs> so you need some good uh, footwear to go with them. And those were two pound fifty for two pets. And you've got these are just black, black, and then that's pink, and then and then tan. Uh, got some cosmetic pads, 90p, always handy to have. I use them for my um, my toner. And oh, okay, one last bit of clothing. Oh, she kept the hanger. <laughs> um, don't need that. This is from the men's section, but it's because I knew that I would probably find something in the men's section compared to the women's. It's Game of Thrones. <laughs> and uh, yeah, the women's is just really poor. It's it's either something that looks like a square has just been stuck onto the t-shirt, which is just like the, or there's a you know nothing Jon Snow, which is not really my kind of thing. Um, but the men's, they've got some really good stuff. They've got this hoodie with the Night King on. Not that I want that because I hate the Night King. Um, but they had this t-shirt, which I think, I don't know if David pointed it out or not, but... Yay. Now, I'm not sure if it's supposed to be Viserion because it's in that sort of icy cold kind of colour. Or if it's supposed to be Drogon. It's the same design on the back as well. Uh, yeah, not sure, but at the bottom you've got, oh, sorry, can't do this properly, you've got Game of Thrones and then it says Dracarys, so I'm not sure, yeah, if it's supposed to be Drogon or Viserion, but I like it, it's extra large, so I'll just wear it around the house, that was £10, and yeah, so we are done with the clothing, um, Got some, got some pants for Dave. <laughs> and then, yeah, he only got a couple of things. This was the last thing he got. We got him some Mickey pajamas, and these are really cute because it's got different faces for Mickey. So you've got happy face Mickey, sarcastic face Mickey, shocked Mickey. Um, I think this one's cheeky Mickey, it's really cute and it's a t-shirt and trouser combination and it was £11. That's good because David's been needing some new new PJs. Right, so, oh, so that's that. Okay, right, so that's it. Now it's really just home stuff. Um, I've been wanting to get myself a new blanket and I saw this. The, this section of, right, it's Game of Thrones. So the Game of Thrones section in Watford is just massive. There's just so much stuff there. There's a really cool um, mug, which I can't remember what it says now, but it's huge, it's like a tankard. And it's got all four, uh, not four, 
three main houses on Sir Lannister, Targaryen and Stark. Um, but it wasn't something that I was keen on, but it was very cool. But yeah, the, the collection's pretty good for Game of Thrones, I guess, because it is out in 16 days now. I'm so excited, I can't wait to see it. But anyway, got, got the uh, Game of Thrones throw, and I think it's basically just all the house sigils on there. So you've got um, Greyjoy. You've got Greyjoy. I'm not sure who that one is. Can't remember. That's really bad. Um, you've got Sunspear for Dawn. Uh, and then there's Lannister in here as well. Yeah, I'm quite happy with that, and that was six pounds. And then next, staying on the ugh, staying on the Game of Thrones theme. I don't need this, but it's awesome, <laughs> and you will see why it's awesome. <laughs> I got Drogon's egg, and apparently it is a uh, money box. Oh yeah, I see where you put the money in now, so it's at the back. But I just like it for a kind of prop ornament type thing. It's really cool. Cause I've actually been looking up on Etsy um, dragon eggs because I'd love to have like all three just on display. I think it'd be really cool. Uh, and then I saw this and I was like, yep, yeah, need to have this. They only have this design. They don't have the other two, which is a shame. But I don't know, maybe they might bring it out or maybe they've got it in the larger stores. But I've not actually seen this on Instagram either. So very this was eight pounds and yeah, just have a look isn't it pretty <laughs> and then last game of thrones i got these they are the dragon eggs uh in tea light form i'm not gonna burn them because again these are just gonna be for uh decorative purposes I thought they smelled, but I think I'm smelling my other candle. <laughs> but yeah, how cool are these? And these were £2.50. I love them. So, almost done. <laughs> I couldn't not get these, and I was actually on a mission to buy these because I saw them on Instagram, and I was like, yep, need to have them. Sent them to Dave, like, constantly. Stitchy straws! Look! How cool are they? And... They're pretty cool actually. They're not, you can take, you can actually take them off. So you see here, that's kind of like the, sort of like the ring that you just slot onto the straw. So if anything goes wrong with these straws, you can put them on another one. Or if you have your own particular straw that you like, you can just swap them over if you've got pink color ones or something. Yeah, I'm very happy, £2.50. And of course, I had to get the Stitch Tumbler. How cool is it? They've just got so much cool Stitch stuff. This makes me so happy. <laughs> but yeah, it's got all the cute little stitches on there. And then the cups inside, there are three from, one, one, two, three, one, two, three. Yeah, three from the looks of it. Uh, I don't know if you can see that there. And they seem to be plain, so that's fine because I guess the main design is on here. And that was eight pounds. <laughs> Staying on stitch trend. <laughs> I got the uh, bowl and plate, and it's so cute because look, scrum. So scrum's on the bowl, and then you've got. Stitch's face inside with his little ears sticking out and then obviously the plate is going to be Stitch's face. Yeah. I was so happy when I saw that. I was like, yep, 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 yep. I was debating whether to get two, but I mean, it's just going to be kind of snacky type stuff. So yeah, you don't really need loads. But that was six pounds. Then the last item, although there is one more in there. Second to last. <laughs> I got the Stitch water bottle with the cool silver speckles. Very happy with this. This has actually got a straw in, which I love. So you've got there. This doesn't move, it's stuck down. Um, I like it when you can sort of lift them up like that. Um, 
Baby, you look it's so cute again. Lots and lots of stitches because stitch is cool. And I have a Walt Disney World uh, water bottle which I absolutely love. So this is like my second for when that is in the wash. <laughs> so or in, in being washed up and drying. But yeah. Ah. Oh, and this was five pound fifty. And then the last item I bought, um, I had my sunglasses you see in my Walt Disney World vlogs. Um, they broke. And I was really gutted because I quite liked them. And uh, they were free from a magazine, so it's not like I could replace them. But I thought, oh, I'll see if Primark have got a cheap pair. Because I, I do have other sunglasses, like designer ones. But these ones I liked because if anything happened to them then it wouldn't be so bad because they were just cheap and I could just sort of chuck them around, chuck them in my bag kind of thing if I'm not going out out. Um, but yeah I got these which are quite cool. They're, they're almost similar to the ones, they're darker um, but the pattern wise it's pretty much the same so it's like tortoise shell, turtle shell um, and these are only 150. And that is it. That is everything that I got from Primark. Um, I hope you enjoyed watching this video. Let me know if you uh, liked any of the items which were your favourite. Um, if you've seen any other stitch items that I may have missed, please let me know because I am stitch obsessed. Um, and I want everything stitch. The house is full of everything. But I need more stitch. <laughs> so, um, yeah, please feel free to comment below, give us a like, and if you aren't subscribed already, please do subscribe. I have uh, Walt Disney World vlogs currently uploading at the moment, um, and I'm hoping to get some more haul videos up, some review videos. I'm thinking about doing challenges as well, so if you've got any challenge video ideas, then send them my way. Um, couple challenges are fine as well, David or get on in it, get in on it, because I will make it. <laughs> um, I'm going to go for now, so thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time. Bye!